When you consider everything it touches from hatching to feeding, to the physical production, to the processing, to the selling, it's just huge. The economic impact the poultry production has for not only Northwest Arkansas, but the whole state. With some of the largest companies in the industry, Ozark poultry farmers have had their eyes on a lawsuit changing the industry. At the center, poultry litter and its pollution effect. While it has applications as fertilizer, it's become an issue in excess. There's kind of a disjunct and a physical distance between where the poultry litter is produced and where our row crop products like corn, rice, soybean, cotton are produced. Looking to solve this issue is Fayetteville's carbon chicken by putting the chicken litter to use in a mix with biochar. Uh, biochar is, is really like charcoal, but it's, it's the type of charcoal that's used in agriculture. So, and it's made in a more efficient it way. There. So it's super porous. If we look at it under a microscope, thousands and hundreds of pores which can hold water. We can house our recipe of microbes that are in there. Uh, so it's a transport vehicle to uh, let the plant have access to these important uh, nutrients and microbes. While soil professor and department head Trenton Roberts says others have tried and failed to solve the issue, he admits there are some draws for farmers. It takes what I would consider a byproduct of poultry production and makes it um, much more affordable to transport so we get greater utilization of it. I think what it does is it adds value to their byproduct. Um, in some cases, I think it allows them to take advantage of the actual power generation. Carbon Chicken says there's a lot to the biochar effect, like the way it makes for better soil and chicken health. But one way it could entice farmers is how carbon can save and earn money as a conservation practice. If we can open up the pores and get more moisture in there, that's going to be a huge deal to saving water, saving costs for the farmers. They may not have to irrigate as much or they can skip it. We can just get the biochar into the chicken litter in these big chicken houses and every ounce of that litter that comes out is loaded with carbon and then it goes into the ground. And we're making a huge impact on climate change. In Fayetteville, covering news where you live, Jose Carranza, 5 News.